Hi, my name is Julie from your Wisconsin Better Business Bureau and today this video is going to show you how to upload and place your BBB dynamic seal or logo onto your business's Facebook page. First you're going to go to our homepage which is bbb.org slash Wisconsin. Now once you come to our homepage you're going to go to the business login page in the upper right hand corner. Once you're here, you're going to input your business ID number, your email address, and your password. Once you come to your BBB Accredited Business Exclusive Member Login page, you're going to click on BBB Seals and Logos. You have a couple of options here, but we're going to have you click on Download BBB Seals and Logo for your website, that button in the top left hand corner here. Now once you come here, you're going to go through a little bit of a process in choosing what seal you would like on your Facebook page. First you can choose your seal color, either blue or black, I'm going to choose blue. Then you're going to choose your seal orientation. You can do the horizontal or the vertical. I'm going to choose horizontal. Next, you can decide whether or not you'd like to display your rating. I'm going to say no, just display my BBB seal. And then you're going to choose your sizing. Um, I'm going to choose this one here. So just press select next to whichever seal you'd like to select. Okay. And then it's going to show you what your seal will look like. And then below that, you have your seal code. Now your seal code is very important. This is what you're going to use in order to connect your BBB seal on your Facebook page to your BBB business review. So what we're going to do is we're going to highlight all this code, this text here, and we're going to go ahead and copy that. Now switching tabs, we're going to go over to Facebook. When you log into Facebook, you should be logged in as your personal profile, not as your page. If you want to manage your pages, you can go over here and click use Facebook as. So these are all the pages that I currently manage. The account that we're going to work on today is called the Sanders All-Star Team. So before we do that, we want to go and install the app on our Facebook page. So the app is called Static HTML iFrame Tabs. So if we click on it, it's going to say add static HTML to a page. Now we're going to choose what Facebook page we want. Okay, so we want to select the Sanders All-Star Team. And then we're going to click Add Page to Tab. It should bring you back to your profile page. Now let's go over here to the little pinwheel and we want to select the business page that we're trying to use Facebook as. So here's our page and here's our new static iframe tab. First what we can do is we can click on this little drop down here. Then hover over this and if you see the pencil icon, click it. Then go down to edit settings. For the custom tab name, let's call it BBB Rating. Click Save and then hit OK. So as you can see, it changed to BBB Rating. Now, let's go up here and open a new tab. Go to boston.bbb.org slash install. This is also where the written instructions are for this application on Facebook as well. But what we want to do is we want to copy this image. So we do right click, save image as, and then you just want to save this on your desktop so it's easily accessible when you need it. So now that that's saved, let's go back here. Let's go over to BBB rating and let's go down to edit settings again. And then it says custom tab image. So you want to click change, hover over the image, click edit, and then choose the file. Here's the AB seal. Open. And there you go. 
That is the cover image for the application that we've installed on Facebook. So now we should go back to the Sanders All-Star team. Go back to the app, click on it, and now click Edit tab. So right here in this index.html box, this is where we're going to paste that code that we saw earlier. So if we go back to BBB, we want this application to appear in the top left corner. So what we're going to do is we're going to select top left, then we're going to highlight and copy, then paste that code that we just copied. Click Save and Publish, and then let's preview it. Great. So if you hover over this, this image is now clickable. So anybody visiting your Facebook profile can click on that and see your BBB rating, all of the information that BBB has, and they can do that by clicking here. And they're automatically redirected to your business review. So let's go back and see how it works. Let's do view tab as a visitor. We'll do open visitor mode. So as you can see, all the same information is available here. And this is what it'll look like to people who are visiting your page. So if we go back to your profile, you'll see that the app is here and it's installed.